Limousines epitomize luxury and grandeur, serving as the luxurious mode of transportation for momentous occasions like weddings, proms, and corporate events. However, a league of limousines exists so exorbitantly priced that only the world's wealthiest individuals can afford them. These extraordinary vehicles, owned by the global elite, boast cutting-edge technology and lavish amenities that redefine luxury. From the awe-inspiring Boeing 727 limo to the Rolls-Royce belonging to the Sultan of Brunei, these limousines symbolize unparalleled craftsmanship and exclusivity. Buckle up, earthbound mortals, for I'm about to tell you a tale of extravagance, aeronautical ambition, and a whole lot of legroom. This ain't your daddy's stretch limo, folks. This is the Boeing 727 limo, a mechanical marvel born from the mind of a visionary madman, Frank D'Angelo. Think of it as a flying palace that traded its wings for wheels, a chariot of chrome and luxury that stretches a staggering 100 feet enough to make even the biggest SUV feel like a sardine can. Inside, this beast is a party animal's wet dream. Imagine, if you will, a fully stocked bar, a dance floor that could make Travolta jealous, and even a jacuzzi, because why not? It's like a Vegas nightclub got liquored up on aviation fuel and decided to hit the road. And who owns this, you ask? None other than Frank D'Angelo himself, a man who apparently decided that ordinary limousines just weren't enough. He wanted something that screamed, look at me. Something that could make even the most jaded celebrity feel like they were rolling high. And roll high he does. This D'Angelo, in his very own Boeing 727 limo, a testament to the fact that sometimes the only limit is your imagination and your bank account. So, the next time you're stuck in traffic feeling cramped and miserable, just remember, there's a man out there cruising down the highway in his own personal airplane limo, living his best life. And maybe, just maybe, that will spark a little joy in your day, or at least make you wonder what kind of crazy contraptions other people are driving around in. The world is a strange and wonderful place, after all. And the Boeing 727 limo is a shining example of just how strange and wonderful it can be. Hold on to your pearls, darlings, because I'm about to spill the tea on the Mercedes G63 armored limousine, a car so extravagant it makes a Kardashian's closet look like a bargain bin. Picture this. A G-Wagon, already a beast of a car, gets pumped up with steroids, dipped in bulletproof armor, and stretched as long as your weekend to-do list. The result, a rolling fortress of luxury so secure it could survive a James Bond chase scene and so comfortable it would make your grandma's living room jealous. This baby, crafted by the Canadian wizards at Incas, isn't just armored. It's armed with bulletproof glass that could deflect a sniper's bullet faster than you can say paparazzi and tires that keep rolling even after a nail gun attack. Under the hood, a V8 engine roars with the fury of a mama bear protecting her cubs, churning out 544 horsepower. And if you think all that armor makes it a lumbering beast, think again. This limousine dances on the road like a ballerina on a sugar high. But let's be honest, the real magic happens inside. Imagine sinking into plush leather seats that feel like they were stuffed with clouds and kissed by angels. A bar stocked with enough bubbly to make a champagne fountain weep. A sound system that could rock a stadium into submission. And don't even get me started on the optional entertainment package, which includes everything from a giant TV to a karaoke machine. Basically, this limo is a rolling party palace that can outlast any hangover. Now, who owns this masterpiece of automotive extravagance, you ask? Well, let's just say that if you've got a price tag with more digits than a phone number and a need for discretion that rivals a CIA agent, this could be your chariot of choice. It's been seen whisking away celebrities, politicians, and even the occasional oil tycoon, all while keeping their secrets safe and their champagne flutes full. 
So there you have it, the Mercedes G63 Armored Limousine, a car that's as tough as nails, as luxurious as a five-star hotel, and as exclusive as a secret society meeting. It's a rolling testament to the fact that sometimes money really can buy happiness, especially if that happiness comes with a side of bulletproof protection and a built-in bar. So you want to travel like a king? May I interest you in a chariot fit for a deity? No, not a metaphor, this is the real deal. Introducing the Maybach 62's Landolet, a car so opulent it might make even Louis XIV weep with envy. This ain't your average stretch limo, friends. This is a masterpiece of automotive engineering, a rolling testament to excess and style. Imagine, if you will, the wind whipping through your hair as you cruise down the highway, basking in the sun and feeling like a Roman emperor surveying his domain. That's the magic of the retractable roof, folks. A touch of open-air luxury that would make even the most jaded Hollywood starlet swoon. But the Maybach isn't just about sunshine and fresh air. Oh no. It's got the power of a raging bull under its hood. A V12 engine that purrs like a contented lion and propels this behemoth forward with the grace of a ballerina. 612 horsepower, folks. That's enough muscle to make even the most seasoned sports car driver blush. And if you think all that power comes at the expense of comfort, think again. Inside the Maybach, you'll find an oasis of luxury, a haven of plush leather, high-tech gadgets, and enough legroom to make a giraffe feel claustrophobic. This is where you melt into the buttery soft seats, sip champagne from crystal flutes, and pretend you're actually the king of a small, oil-rich nation. Who owns this automotive masterpiece, you ask? Well, let's just say that a certain DJ who loves the finer things in life and yelling another one, another one, has one parked in his driveway. And it's no surprise, really. The Maybach 62's Landolet is the ultimate status symbol, a rolling billboard that screams, I have more money than you can imagine and I'm not afraid to flaunt it. If you're looking for a car that will turn heads, make jaws drop, and leave you feeling like royalty, then look no further than the Maybach 62's Landolet. Just be prepared to shell out a cool $1.35 million. But hey, you can't put a price on feeling like a king, right? Picture this, a behemoth of steel and chrome thundering down Pennsylvania Avenue, its imposing presence clearing a path through the crowds. This isn't just any limo. This is the U.S. Presidential Cadillac Limousine, affectionately nicknamed The Beast. It's more than just a car, it's a rolling fortress, a symbol of American power and a testament to engineering ingenuity. Forget the flimsy stretch limos of Hollywood. This beast is built like a tank, literally. Its armor plating can withstand a barrage of bullets, while its bulletproof glass is thick enough to deflect even RPGs. And if things get really hairy, it even boasts run-flat tires, ensuring no roadside breakdowns in the face of danger. Inside, it's a different story. Plush leather seats, state-of-the-art communication systems, and an arsenal of gadgets worthy of James Bond himself. The president can conduct business, receive briefings, and even stay connected with the world in the event of a global crisis, all from the comfort of this mobile command center. This beast isn't afraid of a little bad air either. It's equipped with an airtight seal and sophisticated filtration systems, ensuring the president and his entourage can breathe easy, even in the midst of a chemical attack. While the exact cost of the beast is classified, government secrets, you know, estimates put it around a cool $1.5 million. But money aside, this limousine is a national treasure, a symbol of American strength and resilience. It's a reminder that even the most powerful man in the world needs a little extra protection sometimes, and the beast delivers in spades. So next time you see a motorcade with flashing lights and hear the distinctive rumble of a powerful engine, remember, it's not just the president driving by. It's the embodiment of American power, rolling down the street in a chariot of steel and chrome. And that, my friends, is pretty darn cool. Imagine yourself nestled in the lap of luxury 
cruising down the highway in a fortress of steel and chrome. That's the reality of the Mercedes Maybach S600 Pullman Guard, a car so exclusive it makes a Bugatti look like a Honda Civic. At a cool $155 million, this behemoth is more than just a car. It's a statement piece, a rolling declaration of power and prestige. This ain't your daddy's stretch limo. The SN600 Pullman Guard is designed to withstand anything short of a direct nuclear strike. It boasts bomb-proof armor plating, bulletproof glass that's thicker than a phone book, and enough security features to make even Edward Snowden feel safe. Think of it as a luxury armored tank, ready to protect you from the world's most determined villains. But don't let the heavy armor fool you. The S600 Pullman Guard is a rolling palace. Inside, you'll find a haven of plush leather seating, handcrafted wood paneling, and enough technology to make a Silicon Valley CEO drool. It's like stepping into a five-star hotel on wheels, complete with a state-of-the-art entertainment system a bar that would put most nightclubs to shame, and enough space to hold a small party. Underneath the hood of this luxury fortress lies a beast of an engine, a mighty V12, capable of generating a staggering 523 horsepower, propels this behemoth forward with surprising agility. It's a true testament to German engineering, a car that combines the power of a sports car with the comfort of a limousine. This car isn't for mere mortals. It's the exclusive domain of heads of state, government officials, and other high-ranking individuals who require the utmost in security and luxury. It's a symbol of power and privilege. A car that says, I'm important and I'm not afraid to show it. This is more than just a car. It's a rolling fortress of luxury, a testament to human ingenuity, and a reminder that some people just have it all. Picture this, a behemoth of steel and chrome, stretching 70 feet long and weighing in at over 22 tons, thundering down the highway. No, it's not a spaceship crash landing, but rather the legendary Midnight Rider, the largest and heaviest limousine ever built. This rolling masterpiece, the brainchild of Pamela and Michael Machado, is more than just a car. It's a statement piece, a testament to extravagance and automotive ambition. Forget cramped limousines with barely enough space to breathe. The Midnight Rider is a mobile mansion boasting three separate lounges, each more luxurious than the last. Imagine sinking into plush leather seats while sipping champagne from a crystal flute, all the while basking in the warm glow of a crackling fireplace. It's like stepping into a five-star hotel on wheels, complete with a fully stocked bar and enough space to throw a small party. But the true magic of the Midnight Rider lies in its unique feature, a hydraulic lift that can elevate the entire vehicle up to six feet. Imagine cruising down the highway, towering over traffic, and enjoying panoramic views of your surroundings. It's like being on your own private observation deck, witnessing the world unfold from a throne of chrome and leather. Of course, such a luxurious masterpiece doesn't come cheap, the Midnight Rider reportedly cost a jaw-dropping $2.5 million to build, making it a true automotive unicorn. But for someone like Michael Machado, who proudly owns this behemoth, the price tag is just a small detail. The Midnight Rider is more than just a car. It's a symbol of success, a testament to his passion for the extraordinary. Ah, the American dream. Not the one your parents harped on about, but the one that screams, I've made it and I'm not afraid to show it. This is no mere stretch limo, folks. This is a rolling palace, a 100-foot long monument to extravagance that stretches further than your average teenager's attention span. This behemoth was the brainchild of Jay Orberg, a man whose name is synonymous with automotive insanity. He's the guy who brought us Kit from Knight Rider and the Batmobile from Batman Returns. So, you know he's not afraid to push the boundaries of what a car can be. And with the American Dream, he pushed them right off a cliff. Forget your boring old limousines with their measly TVs and minibars. The American Dream is a playground for the super rich, complete with a swimming pool, a helipad, because why not, and even a king-size waterbed. 
Imagine cruising down the highway, taking a dip, landing your helicopter, and then snuggling up on a waterbed bigger than most New York apartments. It's a level of luxury that would make even Jay Gatsby blush. Currently, this automotive marvel resides in the Deserland Park Car Museum in Orlando, owned by the equally extravagant Michael Deezer. It's a fitting home for such a unique vehicle, a place where dreams are not only dreamed, but also built and driven around on a 100-foot long limo. So next time you feel like life is getting you down, take a moment to imagine yourself cruising down the highway in the American dream. It's a reminder that anything is possible if you have enough imagination and a whole lot of cash. And who knows, maybe you'll even inspire someone to build an even crazier car, pushing the boundaries of automotive excess even further. Because in the land of the free and the home of the brave, even our dreams are built on wheels. Hold on to your capes, Gothamites! The Batmobile has undergone a metamorphosis, ditching its crime-fighting roots for the world of luxury transportation. Enter the Batmobile Limousine, a behemoth that's equal parts menacing and surprisingly comfortable. This isn't your average stretch limo filled with disco balls and questionable karaoke renditions. No, this Batmobile is a purpose-built beast inspired by the iconic designs of Jay Orberg from Tim Burton's Batman movies. Think sleek lines, aerodynamic curves, and enough chrome to blind a bank of paparazzi. But this Batmobile isn't just about looks. It's packing a V8 engine that roars like a banshee, capable of launching you from zero to 60 faster than Robin can say, holy speeding tickets, Batman. And if you're expecting a plush leather interior with a stocked champagne bar, think again. This Batmobile comes equipped with a missile launcher, rear bat wings, because why not? And even ejectable wheels for those moments when a quick getaway is necessary. But perhaps the most intriguing aspect of this bat limo is its owner. Like Bruce Wayne himself, their identity remains shrouded in mystery. Some speculate it's a wealthy eccentric, others whisper of a secret society of bat enthusiasts. Whoever they are, they've got a seriously cool ride and a seemingly bottomless bank account. The Batmobile limousine is a testament to the power of imagination and a slight touch of insanity. It's a reminder that even the most outlandish dreams can come true, and sometimes those dreams involve bulletproof vehicles with rocket launchers. So next time you're stuck in traffic, remember somewhere out there, a bat limo is cruising down the road, a symbol of everything that is awesome, ridiculous, and undeniably cool about the world of automobiles. And who knows, maybe you'll even catch a glimpse of it, leaving you wondering if you should be reaching for your batarang or your camera. Picture this. You're gliding down Rodeo Drive, the sun warming your face as the wind whispers through your perfectly coiffed hair. You're not just in any car, no sir. You're in the Rolls-Royce Phantom Limousine, the epitome of automotive luxury. This isn't just a car, it's a rolling statement of wealth, success, and impeccable taste. Forget your cramped, leather-clad limousines with their flickering disco balls and questionable karaoke machines. The Phantom Limousine is a different breed entirely. It's a sanctuary of handcrafted opulence where every detail has been meticulously designed to pamper and impress. Imagine plush leather seats that feel like butter on your skin, handcrafted wood paneling that would make a forest jealous, and a sound system so good it could make even a tone-deaf Kardashian sound like Celine Dion. But the real magic of the Phantom Limousine lies in its retractable roof. With a touch of a button, you can transform your chariot into an open-air palace, feeling the sun on your face and the wind in your hair as you cruise through the city. It's like having your own private balcony, except it's on wheels and can move at speeds that would make a race car blush. Of course, such a luxurious beast needs a powerful heart. The Phantom Limousine is equipped with a V12 engine that purrs like a contented lion and propels this automotive marvel with surprising agility. It's a testament to German engineering, a car that combines the power of a sports car with the comfort of a cloud. It's no surprise that the Phantom Limousine is a favorite amongst Hollywood's elite. From Kylie Jenner's envy-inducing Instagram posts to Jennifer Lopez's arrival at the Grammys, this car has seen its share of red carpets and flashing lights. 
It's a symbol of status, a rolling advertisement that says, I've made it and I'm not afraid to show it. Step aside, peasant automobiles. Prepare to be blinded by the sheer audacity of the Sultan of Brunei's Rolls Royce, a limousine so opulent it'd make a dragon horde blush. With a price tag of $14 million, this isn't just a car. It's a rolling testament to excess, a 24-karat gold slap in the face of financial responsibility. Think about it. The Sultan, a man who reportedly owns 7,000, yes, 7,000 cars, decided that his collection needed a little more oomph. So, he took a perfectly fine Rolls-Royce Silver Spur II stretch limousine, dipped it in a vat of liquid gold, and sprinkled it with diamond dust for good measure. This isn't just a car with gold accents, mind you. This is a car where the accents are the car. The body, the wheels, even the freaking radiator grill are all plated in 24 karat gold. It's like a giant golden ingot with an engine and a sunroof. But wait, there's more. The interior is a veritable palace on wheels, complete with plush leather seats, handcrafted wood paneling, and enough gold trim to make Midas weep. Imagine reclining in the lap of luxury, sipping champagne from a diamond-encrusted flute, and feeling like the wealthiest person on earth. Because let's face it, next to this car, even Bill Gates looks like a pauper. Of course, a car like this isn't meant for the average Joe Biden. It's for the Sultan of Brunei, a man who can literally afford to pave his driveway with gold if he wanted to. It's a symbol of power, wealth, and a complete disregard for the concept of moderation. So next time you're feeling down about your beat-up car or your empty bank account, just remember the Sultan of Brunei's Rolls-Royce. It's a reminder that somewhere in the world, someone is riding around in a palace made of gold, laughing at our earthly concerns. And that, my friends, is the true definition of automotive excess.